Welcome to another Noob versus Pro, where I'm the noob and she's the pro. Woo. And today we are going to build the absolute emo lord himself from the AFBOW series, Zane. Ooh. Yes, but we gotta do it from memory. We can't, we can't look at any pictures of the man. We're just gonna try to do our best to get his whole getup, all that darkness, and all that secret love for ponies that he won't tell anybody from memory. And with 30 minutes, let's get into it. Woo. Build Zane from memory. Mm -hmm. The darkness overprotective boy that we know so very, very much. We got 30 minutes to build him. Are you ready, Mac? I'm so ready, but I'm nervous about his jacket. Yeah, he's got, uh, here, Editor, put put up a picture of Zane. I can't see it right now. It's right there. That uh, that jacket is something else. And uh, from memory, uh-uh. But we're going to try. I don't know how to do it. Let's go. I'm sure that it will be fine. Bob. Three, two, one, go. Good luck. Oh, 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 dear. All right. So we got to build this Zane fella from memory, huh? Now, I am a little bit of a late entry into the world of Aphmau. Those of you who are Aphmau fans out there. But I, uh, what I do know about Zane these days is that he is a very overprotective, nerdy man who also loves a girl that he can't ever see to actually talk to in a romantic manner. Get out there, Zane. But this is a man who loves his uh, friends as much as he loves his robots. And he loves both of those things a whole heck of a lot. And today we are going to make sure that he has room for both because we're going to build a statue of the man as accurate as my old noobish brain will allow me to do. Because again, from memory... <laughs> Uh, we got it. We got to start building this guy. We got to. We got to start building this boy. Uh, as with all Minecraft skins, we're gonna try to build it as accurate as possible, which means uh, that we're gonna do this pixel by pixel. Uh, we're not gonna do. We're not gonna inflate this thing where we have to do two or like four pixels per pixel. But that means that per Minecraft rules, and I, I, you know, I, I don't invent the Minecraft laws. I just enforce them. Four by four for the legs, and that is gonna be side by side here. So one, two, three, four. These are the legs right here for good. Zane. And then it's going to go up 12 high. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. And that is the length for the pants that uh, Mac was so very nervous about. So that's my yardstick for how long this boy's legs got to be. But I I, I I, don't think the shoes are done yet. Hold on. I think I think he's got like a white label on these here shoes. I could be wrong. And then just kind of build it up like this. That, that feels about right, maybe. I don't know. I've never worn shoes before. All right. Let's keep moving. What I kind of want to do is like go through and see if I can find all of the dark, all the grays of Minecraft. God, that what a what a vibrant thumbnail this will be right because i think there's like a difference in the color of his of his like pants as it goes up as well so maybe maybe something like this he's got legs but not much else okay we need to work on the rest of his body now as previously discussed the hardest part of the zane body is gonna be the body yep no, it's the jacket. The jacket is the scariest part of Zane. He's got all these different sort of flowing sort of shapes and things. It's almost like a, like a flower or a fountain of darkness, of emo rage contained within a single jacket. And I got to figure out how the heck to do this. You sure? You sure? I'm going to start with like a strip up the center here. And then maybe I'll try to kind of layer things off of that if I could help it. And then even then, I think there's sort of like a V shape at the top of this thing. So there, that's... It's, it's kind of what I'm thinking might be how this plays out. We'll we'll see how this ends, but it's a start. It looks like I can. <laughs> what I what I've essentially built is it looks like a pair of drivable pants. Mac, just let you know we got 20 minutes left. 20 minutes, two zero minutes. You are ruining my montage shadow. Ah, I live for it. You haven't ruined one in a long time. I was like switching up my montage game on you and here you are yep. ruining it yep that's how i be no it's you know it, you know sometimes people need be. some people need coffee some people need tea to wake up in the morning i need a ruined montage so thank you for that so i think i got like the general vibes down on this boy i just don't think i've nailed the actual look of this thing you know what i mean i'm gonna cinch in the waist here put a little bit of extra darkness down here and that's gonna be my zane body oh boy uh uh, uh, it's fine. This is fine. 
Now, for the sake of simplicity, because I i don't think I've ever looked at Zane's back in my life, I'm just going to do the same pattern on the front that I got on the back. But I'm going to kind of wrap around these flavors here and uh, see if that works for me. Yeah, yeah. Just because I'm running out of time and I'm a little nervous about it, I think, you know, I'll tell you, will not be on the thumbnail for this video. Zane's back. It'll be fine. You know what? Just for a fun change of pace, I'm not gonna use the big stripe in the center. I'm just gonna instead use all the colors that I had from the other sides. All right, let's take a look at our work. I mean, is it right? No. Is it the right vibe? Also, probably no. I, I think like I think we're in the right neighborhood of it all. I don't think I'm that far off. I just wish I was better. <laughs> Okay, I'm adding the skin layer here because I think he's got just the tiniest little bit of uh, skin sticking out. Honestly, that doesn't look terrible. I don't like, I don't really like how the stripes kind of played out here relative to the rest of the color of the shirt, but I think for the time that I have remaining, this could have been worse. So I'm just gonna keep on rolling here, friends. Mac, we're down to 10 minutes. 10 minutes, Mac. 10 minutes. Okay, I just got to the head. Okay. How are you doing? Uh, for some, Usually I work on the head before I work on the arms. Today I'm full on in arm territory. I've, Ooh, uh, okay. I got legs, I got, I, I got torso, I got one arm, and now I'm just repeating the same pattern on the other side. Oh, I am, uh, yeah, just like literally just finished the torso. Sure. Um, there's like one design choice that I'm not really sure about, but uh, we'll like, I guess, cross that bridge when we get there kind yeah, of Yeah, yeah, I know that game. Oh boy, howdy, do I know that game? Yeah, so I, yeah, that's what I am calling future me's problem. Ah, and fun. I love, yeah, I love we'll leaving things to future me. Yeah, future me is like gonna be like, oh yeah, I love this choice that you decided to leave me with. <laughs> yep, yep, I love, I just love causing problems for future Shadow. That's yep. that's really my, kind of my hobby. For it. Yeah. You you live for ruining my montage. I live for ruining future me's life. So, you know, yeah. <laughs> current me loves it. In other words, it sounds great. like both of us have a common enemy, which is, <laughs> which is Max future. <laughs> yes. <laughs> We're teaming up. Take it. Take her down. She's had it too good take for too down. long. She's too powerful. <laughs> All right, so we got to build ourselves ahead. We we need it to be eight big, and I need uh he's he's got like a mask, right? That's like his big thing. He's got like a big mask, like but it's like it's pretty small. Like it's like two pixels, maybe. Uh, let's see if his body is four. I needed to jut out by two blocks on both sides. That's that that is the where the head's supposed to jut out. Okay, and I'm gonna give him a little bit of a masky thing going on. And I also I very much recognize he's got one eye. Well, one eye visible. It's kind of it kind of bounces back and forth whether or not he actually has a second eye or not. And I think that's really funny. <laughs> give him just a little bit of a collar here because I'm a little I don't know I'm a little nervous about just leaving it darkness all the way. But I could be I could be wrong. Could be wrong. I don't know. And I think it's just got a jet black hair. I don't think I really need to go that hard on uh, anything that's not that. Ultimately, I just need one eye. How hard could it be? I think this boy's got blue eyes. Maybe it'll look better in the context of the rest of the face all being haired up here. Uh, if I if I just start to start loading this up with hair and cover up his other potential eye with that hair. So how much time do we have left? Uh, we're down about five, four minutes, actually. Four now, minutes? four and a half. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, like, I'm actually pretty okay with how the head's turned out. I just gotta kind of figure out, I think there's still something missing here that I could be working on. I just gotta, I gotta keep futzing with the hair a little bit until I get to a place that I'm happy with. A little bit more hair on the front here. It kind of has this weird ridge as a result of how I've been kind of assembling this. Yeah, honestly, I don't want to mess with it all that much more. If I do any more, I'm, I'm worried I'm gonna really ruin it. <laughs> <laughs> just out of curiosity, though, what happens if I do something like this? No, it just seems like his, his eye's too small, then. I just don't... I'm not sure if I've ever done three line or three blocks high with the eyes before, but it feels right. I could continue to mess, but I've really kind of committed to the sort of the design of the jacket, and I don't know if there's anything I can do to, like, repair it at this point. Then I really am happy with the head. I don't think there's anything else I really want to do with it. Mac, we're down to one minute! Okay, I literally just finished, so... Oh! Yeah, okay. I'm uh, pretty happy with all that. I'm glad to hear that, Matt, because I have changed the the color of the pants here with one minute remaining. What? Why? Yeah, it's gonna be fine. I think I I I don't have enough time in 15 seconds, so I'm just gonna call it quits. I think that's that's it for me, Mac. Okay. 
Well, I'll meet you up front. All right. All right, Chatter. We yeah. had to build Dane from Afmao in uh, 30 minutes. In 30 minutes. You? From memory, mind you. Uh, yeah, from memory. I think I did okay. I think I, like, some parts of it I'm prouder than others. Uh, but here, I'll just show you. Ta-da! It's Zane. Oh, okay. Yeah. I like that you went with the uh, obsidian. That's like a nice purple block. Yeah. I really, I, I think it really adds to a lot because Zane isn't just pure black, except maybe on the no. shoes and the hair. And I think I think that works out pretty well for, for the jacket here kind of situation. Yeah, yeah. I like what you did with the shoes, how it has like a little tongue on them. I, yeah. I do really like that. Mm. But the pants, I, I don't think I ever figured out the pants. I no, just, uh, there's not, not a lot going on. Right. But the, the jacket, also wrong. But I think I've kind of got the vibe right. Yeah, I, I like I like the vibe of the jacket. Like, yeah. It looks good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And the hair looks good. I, I Really? I think, if anything, I think I nailed the head. I think the head is yeah, the head pretty much pretty right. Good. Right on point. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like the hair, the hair layer. Yep. Yeah. The, the, the mask and all like that. The like 3D hair layer, too. Yeah, 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 yeah. Because because he has the mask. And that mask is, yeah, is part yeah. of the hair layer. So he might as well commit to it, right? Right. Right, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, yeah, this looks really good. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I, I, I guess I'm not, I'm not disappointed in it, but I wish I was better. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Mag, let's go take a look at yours. All right, let's look at mine. All right, Mag, what you got? All right, Shadow, uh -huh. I present to you Zane from FMO. Yeah, there he is. There's the boy. There's I see boy. him. I see him here. Yes, he's got pants. He's, he's got shoes. He's got the jacket with sort of the, oh, strings. Yeah, oh, straw I was strings. Like, the front looked weird, and I was like, maybe I'm missing something. And I was like, I think I'm missing strings. The little hoodie strings. Of course, of course. Yep. And then, uh, uh, we got ourselves, yeah, yeah. This the sleeves look nice. Uh, I like the V pattern on the back. That's different from the front. Oh, I messed this one block up. We're gonna fix that. It's fine. I fixed it. <laughs> and then yeah, you got the oh, the mask goes up. Oh, I the mask goes, goes up. up. I did not, I did not make the mask go up. It's not just the mask. I think it's his hood. I think you're right. I do think you're right about I think that. It's one of yeah. Those, like, hoodies that ha like it's like have a really big hood. That yeah, has, like, you know, yeah. Like, I think you. Those. I'm pretty sure you're right about that one. Oh. Oh boy, yeah, no, 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 that is right. Ah, it's fine, it's cool. But no, I mean, like, I, I think we both nailed it in the sense that this is immediately recognizably Zane, right? This is Zane. Yeah. If you yeah. have any notion of of F mouse stuff, you know that this these two boys are definitely Zane in some <laughs> flash or flavor. And uh, yeah, that uh, that'll do it for us here, friends. Uh, let us know in the comments who which Zane you think is the zaniest. <laughs> which Zane? want you to let us know is who else you would like us to build or what else or just any ideas like we're, 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 we're running out of ideas yep always constantly running out of ideas so please keep tossing those in the comments it really helps until okay. next time friends we'll see you later bye, bye. i'm saying